Let's take a look. So we got now new names, Bonnie and Clyde, a Jack Dempsey six. All right, like it loads the ground because it's my low quarantine tank. But let's take a look. So we got now new names, Bonnie and Clyde, a Jack Dempsey cichlid that just got maiden pair. And I got here is some tilapia chopped up. So let's see if they actually eat. So I'm gonna take a small piece, about this big. And let me see if they eat. There's Clyde right there. You can see him swimming in the corner. So let's see if he eats. Boom, he got it already. Oh, he missed it. Let's see if he goes back. Let's see. Yep, uh, 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 I think he's spitting it out. Maybe it's a little too big, but he's going for it. Okay, let's put a smaller piece, right? So that one's a little too big. Let's say this smaller piece. Drop it inside. Let's see if he goes for it. Yep, ate it whole. That's Clyde. Bonnie's in the corner. So let's take a little small, another piece here. Take it apart. There we go. Let's see if they eat. Eats again. He's eating. He's eating. He's eating. Probably certain what it actually is because first time probably have tilapia, but at least oh, he spit it out. So I'm not for sure what's going on here. So that's the purpose when you ever get a fish that's been in different habitats, different environments. They may not eat right away and you know me I like to experiment with different food from tilapia or pellets and see how they re react right because sometimes it's informed of new food so he did eat it he did go for it so I know he's hungry it must be the wrong type of food so I want to stay tuned let's see if he does eat it eventually but he did eat it he went for it so he is hungry and let's see what else he eats so no, this is day two. It's a wrap. They at least are hungry. They didn't like tilapia, so you got to experiment and see what they do like, and we'll go from there. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Ron Johnson, a mental health coach, student be therapist, and fish enthusiast. Thanks for listening.